everybody my name is Jeremy Jones and I'm back with another video today I decided to give Godap a second chance and this is what happened so stay tuned Brother is engaged, but to start a new life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating, not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. All right, man, I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I make content about sneakers. All right, so let's dive into today's video. Just like I said in the intro, man, I finally, after five years, almost five years, um, I last time I bought off Godap, it was in October of 2017. So it's been literally five years, right, since I actually purchased a sneaker off Godap. So I decided, after you guys have been telling me on the lies in the comment section, hey, Jeremy, Godap's changed, they made some changes, um, give them another shot. And so I finally, after five years, have decided to give them a second chance. Um, considering what happened off of my second experience with GOAT. This will be my third time purchasing sneakers off GOAT. And yeah, so let's just get into this unboxing. Now, I've already unboxed the shoe and just a disclaimer, I had shot the video already and my memory card decided to just take a dump, right? Okay, so this is a reshoot, but neither here nor there, same experience. So enough rambling, let's get to this unboxing or sneaker reveal right okay boom right here all up in your grill if the camera's picking this up i hope so this box is a dead giveaway off rip right okay now i'm gonna give you guys like basically that label now i picked these up off a of goat just like i said i saw this sneaker right y'all already know what this box is if you're in the sneaker community at this point you should already know what this is right okay obviously this is a sb nike dunk and not just any particular one now i I had been watching this sneaker on eBay, looked at it at um, StockX, I looked at Flight Club across the board, even though technically Flight Club and GOAT are the same thing, so I saw that these actually was cheaper on GOAT, and I did use the Insta ship option, right, okay? I didn't use the Insta ship next day shipping, but I did use the Insta, I used the Insta ship, but I didn't pay for the next day shipping because I didn't need them that extra shipping fee, right? Okay, but neither end or there, let's unbox these guys and I'll give you guys my just full on experience about these, right? Okay, this is a grail sneaker for the kids. So this is something I definitely needed in the collection if you feel where I'm coming from, right? Okay, um, let's pop the top on these. Be careful. Ooh, sheesh, right here, man. Well, we got a little paper falling out, but we'll get to that in a second. Let's just unravel these guys. Go right here. And boom, right here all up in your grill if the camera's picking this up, I hope so. Sheesh, very, very nice material on this sneaker. This is a grill sneaker, right, okay. And boom, right here all up in your grill. Let me get the box up out here, no longer needed. And boom, right here, man. Um, yeah, we got the extra laces. Now, I will say this, I'm gonna go ahead and give GOAT a little bit of credit already off rip. Now, I bought this shoe, right, okay? When I bought this, I didn't buy the special box edition. I just bought the regular box joint, and this is what I get, the special box edition. So, I got the special box edition, but I didn't pay for the special box edition price. So, GOAT kinda low-key hooked this up for your kid. I don't know if they remember me from back in the day. Now, I told y'all before I could even use the GOAT app, my account, I'm not gonna say the word suspended, but I actually couldn't purchase off GOAT until actually going through their customer service. So I had reactivated my account with GOAT like months ago, and I finally decided to pull the trick on these guys. We got the extra laces on these guys coming. Got these little special ropes on these, man. Sheesh, and y'all know me, man. Lately, I just been trying to get my SB Dunk game up, and y'all know, man, I've been really just trying to get my Dunk game up in general, but I definitely need my X, my SB joints, joints. So, um, that little paper that fell out on the ground, give me like one second. Boom, comes with that GOAT sticker right here. If you guys can see this, the camera's picking this up, I hope so. And this looks like more, this didn't come, when I purchased the sneaker back in GOAT off of 20, in 2017 is the last time I tried GOAT. They didn't have this, so now we got like a little punch out card. Hopefully the camera's picking this up, I hope so. Look like it says, 
color and shape, material, structure, stitching, sole, label tag, all that's punched out. Skew and size, right and left shoe, um, shoe condition, box condition, accessories. I guess this is like their GOAT verif uh, verification card thing, which I'm not mad at it, right? Okay, overall, like I'll give you guys a little bit of the action right here. I just kind of read that, but this is what it looks like on the front end. Um, yeah, I'm kind of glad I gave these, man. This is something that I needed in the collection. I ain't gonna say need, but wanted, right? I'd be using the wrong word, but this is something I definitely wanted in the collection, and I am loving these guys, man. Um, I did come off the hip with the chips a little bit, but material on this, as you can tell, this is the real deal, Holyfield. So, um, I guess me and Goat are back in business, so to speak, man. I'm very happy with this pickup. Definitely when the weather clears up, man, oh my God, man. Y'all have no idea how excited I am about these guys, man. I know this has the tearaway material on the shoe for the people who are asking. I probably most likely will not do that because I like the shoe the way that it is. But I know if it's meant to be skated, it has that tearaway material. And some people do that, but arguably one of my favorite sneakers right now. Um, that I'm glad that I picked up. But yeah, this shoe came out back in 2020, but don't quote me on that. But I'm also most positive these dropped in 2020 at these skate shops. So yeah, still got that little new thing. I can tell these are the real deal Holyfield, man. I'm very happy with my latest pickup. What do you guys think down in the comment section? And are y'all happy? I finally, after five years, decided to give GOAT like a second chance. Um, Definitely got a few more items I'm looking at on GOAT. And uh, I will be giving them, you know, probably purchase some more sneakers there. Y'all know I usually go on eBay, but this is kind of like GOAT. I can see why people, you know, finally do that. And I'm not going to say my video back in the day kind of made them change things. But if it did, it did. And um, I'm very happy for it. What do y'all think of my latest pickup, man? I'm going to go ahead and get up out of this thing and stop rambling, man. Y'all be sure to hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I made content about sneakers. Again, my name is Jeremy Jones. And thank you for watching. And I'm out.